Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be bringing you my top travel essentials. I did this video before and I really, really enjoyed it. And I think that it's so necessary to have like your certain basics that you go to every time you travel. It just makes traveling a lot more easy and comfortable. I will also link that video here for you so you can see my old top travel favorites. Um, some of these are repeats because they're just staples you have to have, but I switched it up for you and have some updated pieces. So if you'd like to see my top travel essentials, then please keep on watching. So I'm gonna be bringing you my perfume of the month. Obviously when you travel, you have to have a fragrance and it's summertime and I'm bringing you the best summertime fragrance. So this is from Dossier. If you've never heard of them, they're an affordable luxury dupe perfume brand. So basically you're spending $29 instead of spending $200 or $300 on a regular fragrance. They last so much longer on me due to the concentration content. And they always smell exactly like the dupe that they're replicating. So you get your little box, you get your fragrance card. It tells you the concentration, the notes. This is the dupe for the Tom Ford Solo Blanc. This has been my summer scent ever since I first, first smelt this. I'm talking like maybe three or four years ago. And if you've been watching my videos, then you know I transitioned to all clean fragrances. I'm trying to get everything else in my life clean. I did my cleaning products as well. Um, but like certain makeup products I'm using are not clean. Yeah, I haven't like looked into all those yet. But basically this one is called Powdery Coconut. And it smells exactly like the Tom Ford Solo Blanc. So the reason I'm filming my travel essentials is because I'm going to Miami in two days and I want to just show you guys everything that I'm bringing with me and everything that is like super, super essential for you. And this is going to be my scent every single day, obviously, because it gives Miami vibes. It's giving summer vibes. If you've never smelt the Solo Blanc by Tom Ford, it kind of smells like your perfume mixed with, um, like your sunscreen a little bit, but it's just much better. I obviously always have the sprays with you guys. Like, you don't understand. You guys have to have this scent for summer. It's unreal. The thing I love about Dossier is they always have free returns, no questions asked. So if you don't love your product, you can exchange it or return it. You won't need to because it's amazing. Everybody always sends me messages that they bought this and they love this. And I'll leave my coupon code down below. I don't get paid from it. It just saves you 10%. But a lot of you told me you can stack my coupon with the promotions they're having because a lot of times, the more you buy, the more you save. They'll have like 30% off three, 20% off two. So try to stack my coupon code with their coupons. And thank you to Dossier for always letting me bring you my fragrance of the month and sponsoring this portion of the video. So let me show you the rest of the things I'll be bringing with me on this trip besides this perfume. Also, not to mention, this is 1.7 ounces. I will not be checking a bag and this will fit without checking. So thank you. My next one, it's an obvious one, AirPods. You guys have to have some type of headphones. Do not get caught on the plane on a six hour flight, a five hour flight, 15 hour flight and don't have headphones. Also, make sure you charge your headphones. That's a thing as well. Get headphones. They don't have to be AirPods. These, I love though. You just gotta make sure you charge them. But any kind of headphones will do. Just make sure you have some, whether it's listening to music on your phone or watching the movies they have. You always need headphones when you're traveling. I will say, for women especially, always be aware of your surroundings when you're traveling. Like, if you're at an airport, you're waiting for a car, you have your headphones on, like don't do that. Don't be looking at your phone. Don't have the headphones on. Like make sure you know what's happening around you. It's very scary out there these days, you know? But make sure you always pack your headphones and have them in your carry-on bag. Don't accidentally check them. You're gonna regret it. I showed you guys these. These are the Shout To Go wipes. So they come in this little individual package. I just literally used one right here because I did my makeup first and put my shirt on and I got makeup all over it and it all came off. Thank God for these. So I always have these in my car, in my purse, in my travel bag. I found out about these like, I don't know, maybe three years ago and I always have to have them. I buy them for everyone. My husband is always getting something on his shirt so I just pop one of these out. It's kind of like washing your shirt. Some fabrics, like I tried on the silk shirt at the airport and it stained it so be careful if the fabric is particular like silk, but this works on any other fabric and it gets stains out of everything. It's worked on purses, shirts, pants. So always make sure you have this with you. Another thing I always take when I'm traveling, whether you're on a road trip, whether you're on a plane, is disinfectant wipes. Um, I normally have the travel pack, but I ran out, so I need to buy more, but I'm just showing you the ones I get. And also, if you don't have the travel ones, put these in a Ziploc baggie. It works just the same. 
but make sure when you get on a plane, you wipe everything down and then you sanitize your hands or wash your hands. When you get to a hotel, wipe the phone, the clicker, the door handles, wipe everything down. This is so essential for you to stay healthy and not get sick and just not pass on germs. Like this is probably the number one essential item out of everything I'm showing you that you have to have to have. You need this. Do not forget this when you're traveling. Make sure you disinfect everything. So next are my Stony Clover pouches. So I'm gonna be showing you two of them. How cute, can you guys see this? So this one is like a blush champagne color with a little airplane on it. This is the one I take in my carry-on. And this fits so much, like this is a little mini pouch, but this fits so much. So in here I'll have liquid IVs, gin gins, alcohol, like spray alcohol. I don't drink by the way. <laughs> um, tissue, the shout wipes, hand sanitizers, like anything that you're gonna possibly need on the plane. I put medicine in here, like aspirin, melatonin gummies. I keep this fully stocked and then each time I travel, I just pop this in my bag and I'll refill it if something's out, but I don't have to worry about going through and packing everything. And then also um, I put my vitamins or any pills or prescriptions I have in this as well. So I can always get to it really quickly. And the next one I wanted to show you is this. I believe I showed you guys this before. This is like a cream one and it says skin and this fits so much in it. So I literally can fit my entire day and night skincare routine in here. These little face pads to take off masks and skincare, my toothpaste, my peel pads. Um, by the way, I'll link these as well. These are definitely essential. I get these on Amazon and you can refill and put all your skincare body wash, um, face washes, everything in these. It comes with like little scoopers and jars. Uh, here's the jar I wanted to show you. So this definitely fits so, so, so much. I love all of Stony Clover's products. Like I have an addiction. I have so many of the pouches. I have these two I just showed you. I have a large one. This is literally considered, I believe they're medium or they're small. I'll link everything for you, but this fits so, so, so much in it, but if you see the large, I could literally fit all my hair products, I'm talking full size styling products, curling irons, everything into that, plus more, like all my body care, uh, full size sunscreens for the body, everything. So I would definitely look into these, they're worth the money. The quality of like the zippers are amazing. You can stuff this to the brim, the zipper is never gonna break on you. So every time I travel, I have multiple of these bags and then it keeps everything organized. So then you get to the hotel, you literally just pop out each pouch and then you know, oh, here's my skincare, here's my makeup. I did have one of these that I kept my makeup in, but recently I've been using my Louis Vuitton vanity case. So I'll show you this. My husband got this for me for my 30th birthday and it's like the best investment. So let me just show you how much stuff fits in here. I can fit all of my makeup, full, full glam, brushes, uh, makeup wipes, Q-tips, literally, you have no clue like how many products I have in here. Like I'm talking three concealers, three foundations, powders, everything. This is such a good investment. You can also use this for your skincare, your body care. I used to not want to get it dirty and only use it for skincare products, but it's been my go-to for makeup. The last travel video I showed you guys, I used my base makeup bag. That one is also unreal. It fits so, so much and it's like a little small square. But this one I fit just the same amount and it's like I need to get good use out of it. That one I keep all my makeup in and then all my skincare fits in here. I'm literally not even checking a bag for our upcoming trip. If I can help it, I'm not gonna check a bag. They always crack my luggage, lose something, something gets stolen. It's just a hassle you have to wait forever when you land to grab your bag and then you have to get to the airport extra early to check your bag. It's like, no, I'm not doing that. So I can condense everything and put it into one small bag and everything fits. So the next one I wanna mention, but it was just too big for me to carry. I'll put a photo here for you. This is the base carry-on roller luggage. I bought this a year ago and I'm completely obsessed. So pretty much, I think I own almost one of everything from base. It's Shay Mitchell's travel brand if you didn't know. But she comes out with the best products. They're always amazing quality, such a great price point. You can also get them um, at Nordstrom, Revolve. But this rolly luggage, it's so chic. I love that it's beige and neutral. It matches any bags you want to take with it. And it actually fits so much and it expands. It has a lock on it, it has a weight on it. And then I love that when you pull out the little handle to roll it, it has like a little pad at the top so it doesn't hurt your hand from holding it. 
and it has the little 360 wheels so I'm completely obsessed and that fits so so much for me so on the one side I put all my clothes it has a cover that makes sure everything is like laid flat and then on the other side is where I put like my skincare bag my makeup bag and also just a little tip if you guys have designer items I always take dust bags for every single designer item this makeup case she'll always have her dust bag on it to go in the suitcase and then I just remove it once I'm there I usually set up my makeup when I get to the hotel but if I want to keep it in the bag I'll sometimes put a towel underneath it so the water doesn't get on the leather or I'll put the little dust bag underneath it to protect it as well it doesn't matter if you get the dust bags messed up you just don't want to scratch the leather especially the Louis Vuitton one you can get white marks scratched on it really easily and then also on the plane if I were to bring like my Dior book tote or my Louis Vuitton duffel I would put them in the dust bag like just fold the dust bag and put them in the dust bag when you're gonna go through security because um, they love throwing the stuff and like putting on the belt and then also when you're gonna put it under the seat in front of you also always put the dust bag on it to protect it it seems like you're being extra but it's like you're paying so much for luxury items you want to protect them and no one's gonna look at you crazy like if anything it was like if you know you know so people will get it that have luxury items next this is pretty self-explanatory you always need a neck pillow do not forget this if you have lower back problems like me um, you can also use this instead of just around your neck as a pillow you can use this in your lower back area to support because those chairs are so uncomfortable if you have a bad back then you know after sitting for like an hour you're just over it so you can either sit on this put this on the lower back or you can put it on your neck and then I'll get a window seat and I'll kind of like lean and then you can sleep on it um, I actually just got a new one I gave my husband my old one because he lost his this was from the Stony Clover and Target collab and it has a hook like this is unreal my other one didn't have a hook so it's so easy to just attach it to your carry-on bag and this one's baby pink I don't know if you can tell I love pink obviously but this is the same brand that makes these pouches and they did a Target collab with the cutest stuff I think this was like 10 or 12 dollars and I got the last one so I'm really excited about this this is my nurse Jamie beauty bear pillow I've showed you guys this so many times on my channel this is essential just for life in general but it's that essential that I have to take it with me when I'm traveling so I will not sleep on the hotel pillows I have to sleep on this or else I'll get a neck ache so I'm a side sleeper this curve here goes like this on your face so you don't put any of the pressure like to get wrinkles or anything and it's a silk pillowcase it's memory foam it's unreal they also have like regular ones I used to have that one as well I gave it to my husband because he kept stealing mine but they also have replacement silk cases but this is just so essential for your life that you have to take it with you while you're traveling because you can't go back to a nasty cotton pillow and also I do not want to sleep on the sheets at like hotels and stuff so that's already weird but like I don't want it on my face so I always bring this pillow with me no matter if I'm just on a road trip or I'm flying or I'm going somewhere for one day I always take my pillow with me this is one of the biggest keys for anti-aging then to go with my pillow it's like my security blanket at this point um I'll link a similar one because I got this from Bloomingdale's a while ago they don't have it like I have to take this it's like a small blanket it's not that big it's a smaller one but I have to take this with me no matter where I go I have to sleep with this every night it's kind of like my little security blanket as an adult but I put it across like it puts a little weight on you it's not like a weighted blanket but it puts a little weight but on the plane if I'm at someone's house if I'm at a hotel I always have to have my blanket I just think it's essential to travel with one but like the second I come back home I immediately wash it I will not put it back on my bed and sleep with it until I wash it especially if it's on a plane but I had to just share this with you guys I see a lot of people travel with the barefoot dreams blankets because those are so soft so I'll link that one as well they don't get nasty but just make sure you wash them when you get back you don't want to like transfer the germs or anything okay we're down to the last item I can't tell you how often I use this bag I use this bag multiple times a week even when I'm not traveling so this is the base croc work tote it also comes in like a cognac color but when I tell you this is so underrated like it is unreal so I showed this in the last travel video as well but I've used it even more since then like I'm talking about if I'm gonna go get to work done at a coffee shop I take this with me if I'm just going to the rooftop in my apartments I take this with me if I'm traveling like inside it has this pouch here this is for laptops I keep two laptops and a large iPad in there then it has this pouch with a zipper that you can remove 
And the best part about it is it has this little hook where you hook your keys so you're never digging for your keys when you're like ready to get back in the house and you've got back home from a long trip. It has your keys right there. But like, this is so well loved. And then, oh, this is so key right here. It has this pouch and I keep my phones in there so they're like accessible. And then this has a pouch, but this slides on the rolly luggage I was telling you about. So I don't know, it's just major key. And like the amount of stuff, this doesn't look that big, but the amount of stuff that I fit in this it's kind of insane like I've kind of like bent it up a little bit it's really 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 well loved and I can't talk about this enough I don't know how much it is I want to say it's like maybe 150 I got it when it came out but if you get anything from this entire video like get this tote it's the best if you have a job where you have to go to the office or you travel a lot or you just need to take your computers with you like I'm always editing and I'm on my iPad you literally have to have this like you have to I'm taking this instead of my cute Dior book tote just because of the practicality of it. Like, I would love to take the book tote, but it doesn't carry as much. And I don't mind if I throw that one under the seat. You know what I mean? You have to get it. Everything will be linked for you down below as always. So that is everything for my top travel essentials video. I hope that you loved it. Please let me know down below what your essentials are from when you travel. I would love to see what you guys are getting and possibly like upgrade my life. Everything's gonna be linked for you down below, so let me know if you have any questions. Until next time, thank you so much for watching.